Hi, I'm Tiffany with headcovers.com and today I'm going to show you 10 ways to style a square scarf. Today I'm using our 100% pure silk scarf and this comes in a variety of prints and colors. For our first look, I'm going to be making a knotted necklace so you'll take two opposite corners of the scarf and put them together to make a triangle. Once you have your big triangle, you're going to go ahead and take the long edge and put those corners together to make a smaller triangle. Once you have your small triangle, you're going to grab the point of it and you're going to fold it and then just roll it towards the end. Once you have it rolled, you'll go ahead and just make a knot And you want to make sure that the knot is in the center. And now we're going to tie the scarf around the neck. And this is the first look. For look number two, I'm going to show you the classic neckerchief. We're going to start again by making the same first initial triangle. Now that we have our triangle, we're going to take the long ends and bring them to the back and cross them over and then bring them back to the front. And now you'll just tie them in a knot. And then you can adjust it how you'd like. And this is the second look. For the next look, we're going to create a slide knot necklace. We'll start with a triangle again, and you're going to take the pointed end of the triangle and fold it in and continue to fold it towards the long edge. Once you have it folded, you'll create a knot. And you can leave the knot pretty big, and you'll place it at the front and bring the two long ends to the back and bring them to the front again. Now that they're at the front, you'll take each end and place it through the knot. And you can tighten it or loosen it as much as you'd like. And this is our third look. And this is what it looks like with the scarf twisted to the side. For the next look, I've grabbed another print of our silk scarf. Now we're going to create a kimono and you'll grab the corners of each side and put them together and tie a tiny knot. And you'll do the same thing on the opposite side. And now you'll just slip your arms through the holes. And this is the finished look. For our fifth look, we're going to create a shawl. For this look, we're going to start with the same triangle by taking two opposite corners and putting them together. You'll take the two sides of the triangle and put it over your shoulders. And then you'll just tie it in the front. And this is the finished look. With this look, you can even twist it to the side. For this look, we're going to create a knotted headband. And you'll start with the big triangle and take the two long corners and put them again together to make a smaller one. And then you'll take that point and put it towards the center and begin to roll it. Once it's rolled, you'll tie a knot. And then you'll just place it at the top of the head and tie it under your hair. And now we have a knotted headband. For look number seven, we're gonna create a headband twist and you'll have the big initial triangle and take that pointed corner and put it towards the middle and begin to roll. Once you have it rolled, you'll place the center of the scarf at the nape of the neck 
and you'll bring the long two ends to the top and cross them and then cross them again and you'll bring the long ends and tie them in the back. And this is the twisted headband. For look number eight, we're gonna create another headband and we're gonna make the same big triangle. And then you'll take that pointed corner and fold it in again and roll. Once it's folded, you'll center it on your head and then you'll take the two long ends to the back and tie them under. And this is the finished look. For look number nine, we're gonna create a ponytail tie. So you'll start with the bigger triangle and you'll make the smaller one. And you'll follow the same steps of taking the triangle and folding it in. And then you'll take the folded scarf and tie it around your ponytail. And now you have a ponytail tie. For another variation of this look, you could start with the big triangle and tie a bow. For the last look, we're gonna tie the scarf around a purse. So all you have to do is just gather your scarf in the middle and tie it around one of the straps. And this is the final look. For more scarf tying videos, make sure to subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up. Let us know in the comments which look was your favorite. We'll see you in the next video.